working on today is teaching Zeus the rules of tug. Now, tug is his absolute favorite thing to do in the world, and this is only a problem when he tries to tug on the leash and he won't let go. So in his brain, getting the lead on is just a big game of tug, and it gets very frustrating for the volunteers, and I'm sure it'd be frustrating for an adopter. So what, how we're going to help Zeus is teach him the rules of tug by giving him an out command. So right now I'm playing with multiple toys and I'm trying to time when he lets go to get the other toy. I'm saying the word out, then I'm saying the word yes and rewarding him. So I'm setting up some clear verbal markers for him so that he understands that letting go of something doesn't mean he's losing it. It just means that he's playing with a toy that's more appropriate. So it's clear here that when I'm holding on to the toy, that's when Zeus is re reluctant to let go. It's when I drop the toy and the toy becomes less exciting that he'll drop the toy in the mouth and go for the other toy that I'm holding with. So this tells me that Zeus likes the engagement of Tug. It's not so much the toy he cares about, it's that game of playing. So once it's in my hand, that's when he wants to be on the rope. Um, as soon as I drop it, that rope gets boring and he goes back for the one I'm holding. So we can use this to our advantage. Um, and I'm just slowly trying to build up that out command when I'm holding the rope. It's going to take some time, but he's learning really quickly. He's a smart boy. So now that Zeus is a little bit tired, we played, we got some of that energy and that excitement of the game out of the way, we increase the clarity of the rules. I'm going to bring the slip lead in and teach him that those rules apply with the lead as well. So I'm going to ask him to out and I'm going to drop the leash, make it really boring compared to the toy that we've been playing with, so that he learns the lead is not part of the game, um, and if he drops it, the game starts again. This is going to take a lot of repetition um, because he's had a lot of practice playing with the slip lead and it's a game he really enjoys. Uh, but the more that we work with him, the easier it's going to become. And the more clear he's going to be on what he's allowed to play tug with and what he is not allowed to play tug with. So stay tuned and I'll keep working with him as long as I can. Hope you're all having a great day. Thanks for watching.